Hello everyone. My name is Aditya and I am graduate student assistant for the National Student Data Corps. Welcome to the NSDC Data Science Flashcard video series. This series will break down data science topics in simple terms that you can leverage throughout your data science journey. Today, we will be talking about introduction to the time series data preprocessor. Imagine you have a time data set, a time series data set with irregular time intervals, missing values or outliers. Before you can extract meaningful insights, you need to clean up and prepare the data. This is where time series data preprocessing comes into play. Data imputation. Missing data is the common issue in the time series data sets. Let's say you're dealing with daily temperature data and some days you have missing values. To address this, you can use data imputation techniques. One way to impute the missing temperature on day two is by interpolating it between the temperatures of day one and day three and the interpolated temperature of day two would be mean of temperature day one and day three, 70 and 80 degree Fahrenheit by two, giving us 75 degree Fahrenheit. Outlier detection. Outliers can distort your analysis. For instance, when analyzing a stock price time series, you might identify outliers using statistical methods like a Z-score or visualization tool like box plots. An extreme value that falls significantly outside the normal range can be considered an outlier and should be carefully accessed. Time resampling. Sometimes your time series data may be recorded at irregular intervals. To standardize the time intervals, you can use time resampling. For example, if you have sales data recorded at various times or during a day, you can resample it to a consistent frequency such as daily. This involves aggregating the data for each day, summing up the sales figure for that day. Seasonal decomposition. Understanding the underlying pattern in your time, time series data is crucial. Seasonal decomposition helps with that. If you're working with monthly sales data, you can decompose it into seasonal, trend, or residual components. This allows you to identify patterns related to seasonality. For example, holiday, day, holiday sales spikes. The overall trend, for example, increasing sales over time and random fluctuations. Feature engineering. To enhance your analysis and prediction models, you can create additional features from your time series data through feature engineering. Let's say you want to predict future stock prices. You can create lag features by adding columns with past stock prices. For example, you might add column for the stock prices one day ago, two days ago, and so on. These lag features help your model capture dependencies on past prices. Time series data preprocessing is the foundation for accurate and insightful time series analysis. By addressing missing data, outliers, and other data issues, you ensure that your analysis and predictions are based on reliable and meaningful information. We welcome you to follow along with the rest of the NSDC Data Science Flashcard video series to learn more about the data science pipeline, data science ethics, and additional topics to support your journey.